Yes. <laughs> Rafa? <laughs> Rafa and Roger, yeah. <laughs> you know this video with uh, Rafa and Roger? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Laughing like crazy. Laughing yeah. like crazy. I think it, will, like, it can happen for us. No, no, no. We, we can be as silly as we are. Yeah. Yes. That's the whole idea. So, this is good? Civilized? Okay. That sounds uh, exciting. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> It's me, it's me, the drummer. See, the low is really good, no? The sound of the low tone. Yeah. So don't count the mistakes. <laughs> <laughs> There's no mistakes, I think, no? Yesterday we had we had this uh, situation of con a little concert and and I was reading the few few words like uh, lyrics of the song to the skies and I saw like <laughs> Roman was listening because he I even forgot to tell him that it was a song and that it has lyrics and that's something about you know because it's I for me it's so not important that I even forget to tell and mm. and performers are very often asking so. What's about? Uh, what is about? You know? Hmm. How should I? But I never have the answer. <laughs> so I try to lie, <laughs> things, <laughs> make things up to the skies. Yeah. You know, I don't have my phone, so I will not remember. But something. <laughs> no, but really, it was ten years ago. <laughs> to the skies, I wrote in maybe three, two, or some like hours. Really? In one sitting. Wow. And that's the only time in my life that so I... So Mozart style. Oh, <laughs> I don't know what style is that, but, but that was fast style. And I, I love that piece. I mean, it's, it's, it's really like... I mean, I showed that piece maybe to 100 people and <laughs> they, they were all like, very fascinated. Because you are really... I mean, all this strong energy fascinated in from the first minute I love what l I love about sanctification is mm -hmm. to see how this piece requires from artist for performer mm -hmm. to put all of his energy there you know the, mm. the yes. first notes exactly. like, doo, 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 yeah. you, know? you can't be polite no. you can't be normal regular nothing of that no. works so you have to be you know even with the quality of sound is not yeah. that important the power the uh, so I also think it's not for everyone to play this piece because if you are too classically orientated and you can't go out of those borders and limits, mm. it's, you, you, it, it would sound terrible. Mm. There is a bit of a trend if you're a composer. If the score is very difficult, it's a good piece. You remember mm -hmm. it all? Mm -hmm. it's, yes. it's nonsense. Yes, it's completely. There is no way it's related at all. The difficulty of the you know, signs and because it can be very difficult, but it yes. just totally no line or, you know, but now we are living in this, um, yeah, we love this. Uh, I think um, people, uh, yeah. they think, they are thinking complex is good, yes. easy is bad, yeah. you know? In Germany, they have like wonderful motto for that. It means like, uh, weniger is mehr. Yeah. Yeah, so less is more. Mm. Yeah, and and this is I mean we, I think we have to search for something nice, something not only for us but also for the public which is coming to the concert. Holidays. <laughs> <laughs> good answer. Good, good time. Actually yes. good time, inspiring time, um, thankfulness. Yes. 
holidays, holidays. Uh, birthday, birthday, yesterday. Yeah, Actually, birthday. it's the second time we meet and we do a project that yes. is on the time of connecting connect birthday. my birthdays. I just remembered about the scores and stuff that our first meeting, I thought it's totally disaster because I didn't knew you, you know, personally. Mm -hmm. And I remember we, we started rehearsal and I just realized that all the material is in the wrong key or wrong something, you know, mm -hmm. because you tune your instrument mm -hmm. differently. Yes. And then we were missing some bars, I don't know how, you know, sometimes when you print it, something happens there, you know, mm -hmm. with the program, I don't know, some mistake. So this was the first rehearsal, you know, I was super excited to work with him. I heard uh, him, his recording and stuff. And then I was standing there and I thought, okay, this guy will quit this. I mean, it's impossible, you know, there are no score, <laughs> there are lots of mistakes. And, and uh, I, you know, but uh, with he's very patient and he wrote it down, everything. <laughs> so that, yeah, it's, it's, it's very, 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 very easy always working with Roman because you have this sense that it sounds almost better than you imagine. No, it sounds better than you imagine, you know? And I think every composer has this uh, vision of, of the uh, sound, you know, that has to be created. So, uh, this is always unexpected because uh, when he does it, you feel like it gets another level of... But it's, I mean, this is how it's supposed to be, but um, yeah, it's a joy. It was something like two years ago, right? Sanctifications. Mm. And that was a very similar situation that I could recognize I mean, his music in one minute that it's very hypnotizing. There is no music inside. Can it's like one it? long note and... Oh, and you can't play even that one. <laughs> you don't care about if the birds are singing or, or somebody is going to shop. You are in the music. And yes, this this is a, this is the strong side of it. That you are completely in it. Doesn't matter what happens. It's 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 a dream come true. I mean, to to hear this music performed like in this such level. Okay, now say the truth. <laughs> so it was awful, really bad, yes. and disappointed. The music is like ah. Oh. Just beautiful. For example, what we just listened, the beginning of the piece, you couldn't recognize the instrument. I think it's just so. This is the how he does that. I mean, the scale of the tone and and, and colors in the sound, and so so we work like this. I think we try, and he asks, "What do you think about this?" You know, and I say, "Well, cool." Mm -hmm. Or should we do octave higher? Then he says, "No, no, no, octave higher. It's too <laughs> difficult." And yeah. then in in, a, in ten seconds he plays octave higher. It sounds <laughs> like God, you know. <laughs> so, uh, but it's very creative, and we spend like maybe five hours with these few pieces this time, rehearsing. Yeah, I think yeah. so. And uh, it was totally enough. So it's quite fast, but it's deep. You know, it's you feel like, and he is always. Like so prepared, I saw the scores <laughs> on each note, like five signs, you know, and <laughs> it's it's amazing. Yeah. So so when we do our homeworks, it's easy to meet and do everything really easily and uh, with a sense of almost improvisation, you know, looking for things. And do I feel like this? <laughs> <laughs> do I look? How, like how that? close to the truth is it? <laughs> No, I think we musicians are a bit strange, but but I would say everyone. I mean, uh, mm -hmm. really, because we just have different preferences in life, and uh, that's why we are maybe a bit differently orientated into the world and connected to the world. And um, but it's all very. You you think we are crazy or what? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so I don't feel like I'm crazy, but 